Back here at home tonight into the tragic death of a high school quarterback during his team's season opener. The 16-year-old suffering a brain injury during what appeared to be a routine play. Here's ABC's Faith Abube. Tonight, a family and community shaken after Caden Talir, a 16-year-old high school quarterback, died following a routine tackle during the first football game of the season. There are a lot of questions that I know that I have. We need your love. We need your support. His father, visibly heartbroken, joining students and staff today at a vigil. Caden was kind. He was compassionate. He loved every person that he encountered. An official telling ABC News late in their season opener, Caden was tackled to the ground, suffering a critical brain injury. Emergency crews airlifting the teenager to the hospital where he later died. Caden seen here in this highlight reel he posted online. <laughs> He was a junior and the starting quarterback at Morgan Academy in Selma, Alabama, scoring a touchdown Friday night during the game. His tragic death comes as the new school year begins and football season kicks into gear. The National Center for Catastrophic Sports Injury Research finding that deaths during games are rare. Last year, out of nearly 2 million players from youth leagues to the NFL, there were 16 reported fatalities. And David Morgan Academy has suspended all sports activities for the entire week as that community mourns the teenager's death. David. We're thinking about those parents tonight and that whole community. Faith, thank you.